Hello everyone. This is Sitting on Full Food Review. Woo woo! And today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be trying the Sour Patch Kids. Oh yeah. Fire and ice. Now, neither one of us has tried either of these before, so this will be an experience. Now, I'm not sure if these are made out of some kind of radioactive material, but as you can see, Sour Patch Kids freeze. Quite an interesting package. It is. This one's a little. Huh. It looks like the regular flavor. <laughs> but it's hot. Apparently. And they're both they're things. both new. Wonder what the best buy date is. I thought that said twenty first of April twenty eighteen. Almost I was almost like, oh my god. Twenty first of April twenty nineteen, so it should be good. So the ice has blue raspberry lemonade, strawberry lemonade, cherry lime lemonade. And lemonade and then the fuego has a berry blaze uh, Cody you always get you always getting blazed tropical flame my mixtape apple fever and angry watermelon mm, sounds like Tony. Oh, uh, oh. I ain't saying nothing first they're sour then they're sweet sour and sweet. then they're cold God. and then they're hot apparently so we're gonna see exactly. How, we're gonna see exactly how cold and how hot these are. All right. So which one you want, you want to open the hot one first? In, in case they're really hot and be like, oh, we got the cool ones to cool down. I could look at that. All right. With a cooling sensation. Uh. Mm. <clears throat> that was a little. How much you grab it? I don't know how you like to eat these. If you just eat random flavors, I won't. Oh. <laughs> um, I'm having two of them. I'm going to go with the red and the green. As wait, what was the time? His apple fever and. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the red and the orange, as it seems to be the hottest. Well, the tropical flame and the angry watermelon. I don't really see green or purple as hot. Well, I got green and red, so they, they, don't, they don't smell a lot. They smell of sugar and disappointment. <laughs> All right, let's get into it. This is the Sour Patch Kids, flaming hot, going in. My disappointment is immeasurable, and my day is ruined. It's weird. It sneaks up on you. I'd say it's very flavorful. It's a quick Definitely. punch. In terms of it being hot, for a second, it was like burning and then gone. Definitely. Immediately. It was afterwards. I think you have to eat a whole bunch of these. It's like, it's like hot Cheetos. So I tried the red and the orange. Let me try the, the red and the orange. I'm stop. The blaze and the apple. apple fever. Need to take a sick day for that one. He said, "Yeah, just like today." Um, now I'm pretty sure these are supposed to have faces on them, but they're so coated with sugar that you can't see it. Looks like he's gonna go for all four at once. Yeah, look, I got that all four action. Hey. All right. Indeed. Going in. Five second rule. Dog hair included. Did not taste like apple at all. Tastes so processed butt cheek. <laughs> Self pity. I don't know, sour patches kind of disappointing. Dude, the way the hot sneaks up is like weird. Just burns the underside of my tongue, and that's it. You get a weird taste. <coughs> no. <laughs> no. 
<laughs> All right, so we're gonna go for the ice now. So would you re would you recommend the hot sour patch kids? I mean, I I would give them a try. If you never had them, definitely give them a try. <laughs> um, they're not that much different from the regular sour patch kids, just with a little a little uh, kick or something. I'm not. I'm not sure if it's a, a radioactive material or maybe based around a nucleus. I'm not sure. Oh my gosh. Alright, so now we're going to move on to the Sour Patch Kids. Freeze. Time to get cold. When you're when you're in the summertime and the heat, there's no better way to cool down than when Sour Patch Kids freeze. <laughs> I doubt it. See what I did there? I froze. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I think I'll just take all four out. Get it over with. Now these, these wow, these smell way different. It's not your turn yet. smell of sugar and not disappointment but I'm giving a heavy heavy sense of wood <laughs> as if it's been sitting in a, a barrel as it's been shipped across the country with an Italian origin and a dice of child labor oh god alright you ready for this this is the Sour Patch Kids freeze We're going in that was the lemonade. Didn't taste very lemony. Just tasted like sugar. Alright, so we're gonna go for the, what is it called? The green is, uh, cherry lime lemonade. Never heard of such a fucking flavor before in my life. Going in. Not bad. Strangely, taste of of the uh, it tastes like apple to me, <laughs> with a slight hint of cherry medicine, which is appalling, absolutely infuriating. I think the freeze that comes on afterwards almost is like a short, short like, minty thing. It's like yeah. it legit happens. Boom, it's gone. This is strawberry lemonade. It's absolutely horrifying. And to be honest, if you just want to snack on something, get the original ones. This tastes of eroded leaves in the spring season when it's raining. They've been laying in mud, secreting all day. And Austin's chilled fungus. And this is the uh, blue raspberry. I love blue raspberry, so this better be good. Blue raspberry. Going in. No blueberry, no raspberry, no lemonade. It tastes like it's been sitting between someone's toe after a football game. Absolutely rancid. As far as the freeze goes, there's a little bit of freeze. Not all too much. Felt weird when it hit your chest. Now I am curious as to what happens when you combine. Oh, you got a smart idea. Let me try to combine them. Hot and so we're gonna see what happens when you combine the Sour Patch Kids fire and freeze. You would think it'd be called ice. All right, ready? Yep. Go Going in. in. Doing that double stack. Hmm. I taste more of the ice, but the, the fire is in. Yeah. And now 
Ah, for life.